according to Google, context is the circumstance that form the setting for an event, statement, or idea, and in terms of which it can be fully understood. In simple words, the environment or circumstances surrounding something is context. The something can be a word, sentence, concept, or pretty much anything. I'll demonstrate with a word. What type of a noun is school? Every child should be able to attend school. Here school is a common noun. I saw a school of fish out of the submarine window. Here school is a collective noun. Challenge me again and I will school you. Here it is not even a noun. It is a verb. The same word school in three different contexts. How about a sentence now? Congratulations on your achievement is normal at an award ceremony or a promotion, but not at an accident. My point is, almost if not everything depends on context. This is not specific to the English language. So when reading or writing, listening to and understanding someone, keep the context in mind. The earth is flat is wrong within a science convention, but absolutely fine on stage at a comedy club. Next, as you can see in the title of this video, we arrive at subtext. According to Google, subtext is an underlying and often distinct theme in a piece of writing or conversation. In short, subtext is the unsaid and often hidden meaning behind the visible or audible words. Interestingly, subtext can be implied even without words, by only music and or action. An excellent example is a musical short film, A Cherry Tale, made in the year 1957. It is 10 minutes long, link is in the description. Anyway, here is an iceberg representation of subtext. Most of us know that something like, I'm fine, can be loaded with subtext. Take a look at this picture. The dialogue from the husband is, Before marriage, I always felt incomplete. But the subtext in both of their minds is different. Stress plays an important part in the subtext, but that is for a future video. I hope you learned something new about using and understanding language. Thank you for watching and thank you for the 100 subscribers.